Hello, everyone. This is Miss Maria from D1 Technology from China. Today, I will make brief introduction for our K600 Plus display. First is the software wheel tool. This is debug assistance. This is the development guide. I also prepared some pictures for the project. Now we open the software wheel tool to create the project. Click new project. Set the resolution. Select the store path. I create a new folder. Okay, this is the interface. Now click add. Add all pictures into the interface. Click save. Direct configuration file. Now let's say what's in the Dune set file. In Dune set, you can see the picture. The 13 touch control, 14 variable config, 22 config. I like to show some function for the display. First is the image animation. Draw box. Click property. Start image ID 0 and image ID. You can select the ID you want to jump to. I like to display to 0, 4. So I select four, page four. Save. And in zero four, I want to use the touch configuration to change to the other page. Click. Draw box. Here you can add the button effect Put the similar picture in the display. Select is zero five. Select jump to picture zero six. In this page, I like to show you the variable data display. Click data variable. Draw box. Right side, you need to set the function, especially for the VP. Now we back to the develop guide. Here is the consist for the DGAS software wheel. Above is the TFT driver and display. Left is touch config, variable config. Right is the text display, icon display, graphic display also phones. And below is the register buffer, variable buffer, trend call buffer. They have special command definition. So for VP, it belongs to the variable buffer. 82 means write, 83 means read. For the register is the definition hardware interface 80 zero right 81 read also for the curve you shall use 84 let's change to picture one this page you can see the scope for the different for the buffer register is from zero zero to FF. Variable buffer, the scope is 0, 0, 0, 0 to 6 FFF, which means the VP should be within this group. Right side is for the naming rule for the flash. 
I said, zero, zero, one zero. Select color. Font ID for the data display always use zero. Font size thirty two. Ensure the box is larger than the font size, otherwise the data won't be show up. Also alignment mode. Variable type. INT means integer. You can see the scope for the integer. If you want to show more number, use the non-integer. Also double line integer. Besides that, if you want to show the decimals, please note it's fixed point decimals. Here I use the integer. Number three, save. Generating configuration file. Here is the file in the given set. It's also we need to download to the display. It has been defined in the development guide. I copy a config into the dual set, which is an important file. Now let's we figure out the meaning for the config. Change to 12. One by one from R0. R0 is about the display resolution. No need to set. R4 is for the bit clock. No need to set. R1, R5, R9 is for the baud rate. If R1 equals 11, baud rate up to R5 and R9. You can calculate by the formula, formulation. In this file, R1 equals to 0, 07, so the baud rate is 115200. R3 RA is for the frame head, which is also D1 protocol. We set, normally set R3 equals to 5A, RA equals to A5. After head is the nurse. Also command 80, 0 to 84, register variable buffer, also the curve and then data, including the VP address, also the data you want to show up in the display. You can also select CRC check. R2RC is defined by bit to config operating mode, which is quite important. From 8-bit to the hex format, either 0, either 1. If you want to upload the data to the UART serial port, select one for the bit 3. Also, if you want to display the initial value, select one for the B2. For the refreshing period, normally we select 0, 0. Let's check. What's Zero C meaning. One one zero zero means upload the data to the UART initial value. For the bright list, if you select one, you need to further set up in R6, R7, R8. You can find 
the definition for the R6-R7-RH. Here is the RC part. Similar regression rules with the R2. From the baller to the hex, 8-bit. I say equals 0, 0 means all select 0. Here is the file type in the SD card in the given set. We also need to display the data, so we need a font. You can generate the font by yourself in the welcome interface in the software view. Click. Select font, size. Also adjust the distance. Create. The font will be stored in the software view too. Copy it. Put in the DIN set. You can also generate the ICO, the small picture. Select the path of image file. Build ICO. Store in the DIN set. I named 35. In this file, you will see the 35. Now we need to download the files into SD card. Here is the display I use. RTC, Seraport, USB NAN, SD card, adapter, TDL to USB, 10 pin wire, blow up, other side also blow up, connect to the serial port in the display. Now we collect to power on the display, the SD card, USB. Power on. The display turns blue. The picture in the given set show up one by one. Image animation just show up. Directly jump to zero four. Now click the touch control, change to 06. Now we need to use the protocol. Use the SSCR, the debug assistance. Let's make the comparison. Five A five is the frame head based on the protocol. Then dataness, I just leave it blank at this moment. Command is 82, write data to the variable buffer. VP is 0010. I want to display 100, so put 0064. So there are total five bytes, length, zero five. Send, 100. 50. 34. Five. This is the interface for the command send. Here you can see what command I sent you. Today's tutorial is over. That's all. Thank you.